hello everyone this is day 18 and video number 18 so today we're going to start this uh, reading this book this is class 6 book english for today so let's get started to read mm, okay here is the first page okay so here is the first page going to any school all right so this video will be 15 minutes i mean this video length will be 15 minutes so let's get started you know, uh, one thing happened like when I was start this reading and when I was finding out the book, um, I just finding out in a good book, but uh, I just spent all the day and I'm not able to make a decision for finding a new book. And then I think, okay, uh, since uh, I just reading class five book, l now let's start uh, start uh, class six book. Then I will move class seven. Okay going to a new school after completing the lesson student will be able to read and understand text talk about people place and familiar object in short and simple sentence write short paragraphs okay if they read then they will be able to do that you know <coughs> okay torun has moved to a new city with his parents he is going to a new school and his new te teacher has give, given him the following form to fill out. His teacher wants to know more about Torun. Read the form and see what Torun was writing about himself. My name is Torun Choudhury. I am 11 years old. I have, I have brown eyes, um, brown ears. Um, and I am 4 feet 3 inch tall. I am go good playing, good at playing football and drawing. My hobbies are collecting stamp and reading. I like to read comic book and eat peer, uh, peer to, peanuts. Peanuts. What's the uh, spelling? Let me find out it. Now what is? It's called peanuts. China badam. Okay, I really don't like any... Uh, of soft drinks okay that's good write your own uh, down similar information about yourself so i'm not going to do that read and following pa passage about torun first day in the new school my first day my first day at this new school was interesting i was going to school with my father in a rickshaw rickshaw, rickshaw right reach school after t uh, 15 minutes my father said goodbye and left me at the new school gate. I went in and found that everyone had gone to class. I walked into my classroom and found a seat. After some time, we, a teachers come and warmly getting us, greet us, greet, greet us, warmly get us, warmly get us. What's the meaning? Okay, so it's one kind of opportunity. Warmly greeted us. Okay, great. Opportunity. Okay. Uh, I found the students very friendly in new class. Okay, that's good. They're friendly, they say. Choose the right answer the passage is about. Who took Tarun to school at first day? His father. How Tarun failed on the first day in, in school? And why they feel so? Um, what? Uh, mm, Plus, um, sometimes it's, uh, Oh, I don't have any idea about that. What happened in the school on the first day? First day. Uh, mm, oh, okay. So, uh, first day, the teachers come and warmly greeted us. And that's it. Match a word from column A with a word or word from column B that has or have similar meaning. Interesting, interesting, um, glad, right? Interesting, uh, I don't know, let me find out. Frightened, frightened, we already know the meaning, but let's forget it. Um, oh, frightened, man, who is a veto or afraid, man, veto. Happy, cushy. Glad manu kushi, excited, um, warmly, um, I don't know that, I'm not going to try, you know. Talk about your first day in school and how felt, 
happy, frightened, thrilled, or shy. Work in a group. Um, now write a paragraph on how you felt on your first day at school and why you felt so. Okay, that's good. Uh, let's play Kate Greenery Greenaway. School is over. Oh, what fun! Lesson finish. Play begun. Play begun. Play begun. Uh, begun mane ki beginner begun shuru kore right e rokom bujhe dise who will run faster you or i who will laugh louder let's try that's good okay congratulations well done after complete completing this lesson the students will able to ask and uh, answer question read and uh, understand write an instruction Parti uh, participate in short dialogue and conversation and family topic we often acha again i forget the often meaning oh pray i'm gonna pray use some routine ex expression in our everyday conversation read the following conversation and see some of the different way in which we can respond to a good or bad news bt's elder brother babul goes to college in dhaka Bt and her parents live in small town in Tangal district. Babul is talking with her father over telephone. Babul, hello dad. Dad, Babul, how are you? Babul, fine dad. I saw I just got my exam result. Uh, I have got I I have got a A in my English test. Dad, well done, son. I am so proud of you. Babul, thanks dad. Uh, by the way, I have to go now. Um I will call you again. Dad, bye, son. Take care, Babul. You too, Dad. Bye. Rahul is good singer. He loves to sing folk songs and uh, is quite popular with the younger generation. His new album has just come out. Nina, Nina, right? Nina, or Nina, Nina or Nana. Hello, Rahul. You look very happy today. Rahul, I'm happy. I just hear that you, my new album of Lalone songs, has been. And has been a hit. Nina, oh, great! Congratulations, Rahul. Thanks, Nina. I I, I cannot tell you um, how happy I am. Montezur is a student of Class Six, a government high school in Rajbari. Recently, there was an inter-school uh, essay completion uh, competition competition on the Oscar session or. Uh, Occasion, occasion, right? Uh, occasion, occasion of the Independence Day. Manzur had participated and got a prize. Ras, hello, Manzur. What is the matter? You look excited, Manzur. You, re you remember the com competition? I took part. I'm here to answer you, Lam. Ras, oh yes, I do. What happened, Manzur? I'm happy um, that I have been. I have. On the competition. In fact, I have won the first prize, Raj. Oh, that's marvelous! Congratulations! That's marvelous! Congratulations! Um, Mantaju, thanks. When we are glad or happy to hear about any news, we usually express our happiness with this expression. Congratulations! Well done. That's marvelous. That's wonderful. Great. It is a in return other person usually say thanks or thank you. So it's a good thing like if a if we got any kind of happy news, then usually we can say um, congratulations, well done. That's marvelous. Oh, that's wonderful. Great. Okay. Discuss with your friend a meeting generation album hit as they have been used to conver conversation above. The word album and hit can be used in more than other meaning discussion in a group and see if you can guess the other meaning. Okay, I'm not going to do that. Let's now see what we say when we hear about something not good or not happy. Read the following dialogue. Okay. Bobby, hi Shujan. Why did not you come to school last week? Shujan, I had the flu. I was in bed most of the time. Bobby. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. How do you feel now? How do you feel now? How do you feel now? Shaquille. Hello, Manik. Why are you so quiet today? 
Manek, did you see the pain my father gave me? I have lost it. It was very, very dear to me. It was very dear for. It was very dear to me. Shakil, oh, I'm sorry. How did you lose it? Manek, I don't know. I think I dropped it somewhere. I don't know, but I think I dropped it somewhere. Okay. Shanu, hi, Manira. Have you seen the result? Yes, I have failed in my math test. Shanu, oh, that's bad luck. Munira, I don't know how to tell my parents. Shanu, I think, hey, uh, they will, I think they will understand. I know you will do better next time. Okay, language focus. When you, when we hear about bad news or not good news, we say, I'm not, uh, I'm sorry to hear that. I'm sorry to hear that. Um, or that's ha that's hard luck. That's hard luck or that's bad luck. That's hard luck or bad luck. In response, the other person usually does not say anything. Okay. Uh, what would you say somebody who have on the lottery? Congratulations. Good, uh, good luck. Or I'd say congratulations. Well done. Has lost. He lost the first match. Oh, that's bad luck. That's bad luck. I'm so sorry to hear. I'm so sorry to hear that. Mm, it's a uh, the bad luck. It's a bad luck. The bad luck has been. Congratulations, you on your good result. Congratulations, well done. Uh, have been ill. Uh, so I I was ill. Uh, sorry to say, I was ill. Have been ill, right? Have been ill. Chilo na ki buslam na bisha question dai bojene. Uh, have been selected for music program on TV. Mm. Have been have been selected for a music program. Okay, that's for today because uh, my concentrate is not in my book. That's why I cannot um, answer this question. I have to go. I think. Um, thank you for watching this and uh, I'll try to make another video in this uh, day if I have free time. Uh, I think I don't have free time because I have to make another video on my channel. So it's one kind of busy day. But thank you so much. Bye.